Hey, so you. great to, so see good you. to see you. Oh, this is my fiance, Hi, Hale. I'm, I'm Hale. Pleasure to meet you. Hi, Hale. So, so good to meet you. you. Now you get to meet the other half of my heart. The reason why his and brain's the way it is. The reason why my yeah, brain yeah. is calmer, maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Well, and you say it's your heart, but it's part of your brain. Yes, exactly. Right? It comes to that's, live in your brain. That's too smart. Are you excited to see your I'm brain? I'm so excited. I don't know what to expect. I'm nervous. I'm definitely nervous. <laughs> Have you been bad to your brain? Possibly. No, no, actually, no. <laughs> He's very I'm good. actually, like, really good. Yeah, like, no drinking, no nothing. So let's go. Awesome. <laughs> well, let's go find out. So I read your history. Okay. And I looked at your scans. And I looked at your testing. Uh, you're actually very bright. Oh. <laughs> so the goals from what I was reading to learn about your brain and your memory is not Yes. What it could be. And you be. want that to be better. Mm -hmm. Some OCD tendencies yeah. and panic attacks, but that was mostly in the past. Yes. I've been controlling it lately. What else should I do? I really, it's definitely predominantly focused on the memory stuff. I mean, I've been really zen lately. I'm like, I'm really good. I'm in a really healthy place. So it's truly just that I don't understand why I can't remember things like... Your childhood. A couple, definitely my childhood. That's all a race. I have no idea what I even was or who I was or any memories about my childhood. But even then, I don't remember things about my college and people I knew. I don't remember like a year, like a year of those. It's been, I'll have like moments where I'm like, oh, that stood out to me and stuff like that. And I'll remember specific incidences. But in terms of like really, I, I feel like a lot of my life has just kind of been erased. I'm just like kind of, I'm in the moment for sure, but like I don't remember anything that happened. And that also, for some reason, goes along with then, I feel like, in terms of profession, um, I definitely struggle to keep, like, I can put things in my short-term memory, quote-unquote, pretty easily. And I'm like, okay, I got it, I got it. But nothing, like, especially with learning lines and stuff, it doesn't ever seem to transfer over to my long-term memory as I, I was as easy as I feel like it should. Um, and I feel like I don't know what's happening to block that, that um, create a wall there. But um, it's... Weird. If, if there's definitely something there that shouldn't be. Um, definitely something abnormal. So, I'm yeah. going to show it to you. Great. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to show it to you. <laughs> you test actually very well. Oh, yeah? In fact, um, let me just run through these quickly. So we do some, we did a study called Total Brain. Okay. We're in front of a computer. Right, yeah. So you're actually wow, look at your really memory. good at recognizing faces. Mm -hmm. You tend to have a FBI pattern where you notice what's negative faces faster oh, okay. than positive faces. That, that often goes with some childhood trauma wow. where they, <laughs> they taught you, I need to watch because things are unpredictable. It's funny that you say that because... I've always like given myself like I've always said it's like an, uh, like a skill of mine to like I can recognize when some, bad you oh, no not even bad people oh. even with you oh. whenever no you no just kidding yeah um, anytime someone's feeling like any sort of emotion oh he knows immediately I, I know immediately so I, I see the slightest difference in someone's face I'm like oh okay what's up I, I do it with him all the time yeah. like hmm, okay Frankie what's he goes, what are you thinking what's happening what's right going now? on and so I'm it's like funny you said that. wow. <laughs> Your memory, because that was one of the issues, is freaking amazing. Yeah, yeah. Well, I remember doing that test and like having to go back and remember what we, uh, like what the words were. Whatever it was. The path. So, that wasn't hard for me because I still, like, I don't know. Short term. I felt short term still. Well, your short term memory is awesome as well. Flexibility was not aye, aye, aye. so great. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, shifting attention. So I don't know. Oh. Sometimes you get stuck things really i really okay so wait can we elaborate on that i'm confused so it's shifting attention being able to go from this to that from this to that okay. and not get hung up on what happened before so uh, sometimes on scans i see your gear shifter can be a bit busy got it okay and and which means if somebody hurts your feelings you it's unbelievable if we if there's something that happens that is upsetting to him there's oh, that's no where... moving on until that issue is resolved depends on the, the, how extreme the, the incident was yeah. but if it is extreme enough to make me feel something yeah that would go hand in hand with my panic attacks where i would be mm -hmm. i've had days where i did like spiral I'm about paralyzed, one issue i told it i'm like yeah. i'm not doing anything else still so that would make sense i guess at that point yeah yeah, yeah. and it's just 
often some simple skills to help you share mm -hmm. when you get stuck. Totally. I call it the bathroom technique. Mm -hmm. It's when you feel like you're really stuck or your partner is really stuck. Just take a break, just like five minutes. Unless it's really intense, take a big one. Uh, and just if you can get a break from it, your brain will then shift. Right. But if you find, you know, you're discussing an issue and it escalates and both people get stuck, it can get ugly. Mm -hmm. And so if you just notice, oh, I'm getting looped into looping in this, take a break and then come back. Right. And often if you guys want to talk about something like really important, go take a walk and don't talk about it for like 10 minutes. But after 10 minutes, you'll both be more flexible mm -hmm. and your empathy will. That's, yeah. a, that's, a, that's, a, what that's I a cool tip. Tell you to um, your tell focus too. was fine. It was really good. Um, but your scans are really interesting. We do a study called SPECT and SPECT looks at blood flow and activity. Okay. Looks at how your brain works. And it basically shows us three things. Good activity, too little, too, or too much. And then my job is to balance it, right? right? I mean, that's what Frankie and I are working on. Um, this is an example of a really healthy scan. The image on the left, we're looking at the outside surface. It should just be full, even, and symmetrical. Um, the color doesn't matter, it's the shape. Yeah. The image on the right, color does matter. Blue is average activity. Red and white are the most active parts of okay. the brain. And they should be in the back bottom <laughs> part of the brain in an area called the cerebellum. It's Latin for little brain. It's got half the brain's neurons. So it's only 10% of the brain's volume. It has half the brain's neurons. And that's wow. why you see all the white. This mm, right, right. That's you, my little brain. When we look at your skin. Oh, look at you. At rest, it's really sleepy. And this is probably why you're having memory. Mm -hmm. because it's just not got enough energy. With this pattern, often you can wake up and sort of not feel like your best, but as you get going and get doing things, your brain kicks in and works better. So my question in regards to that, then, like, why is that a direct effect on memory, would you say? In terms well, of like long-term? the memory centers of your brain are in your tongue. Uh, and your temporal lobes are really sleepy. And, and when I say sleep, I just mean it has less blood flow yeah. than is good for it. And if I can make it better, you're going to like me a whole lot. <laughs> so you don't have holes in your brain. What the holes mean is low blood flow. I set a certain threshold. So okay. I tell the brain, I want to see a certain level of activity. And I always set the threshold at 55. That means I'm looking at the top 45% of brain activity. Okay. Anything below that is below healthy and shows up as a hole or a dent. Gotcha. But if you do what I ask you to do hmm. over time, it can look like this. And so what I do is I change the threshold to 45. Yeah. And I'm like, it can be just completely wrong. Tell me about work. Tell me what you do at work. Um, so I do two things. I'm a streamer. Uh, I don't know if you have your Twitch. Twitch. Uh, vaguely. It's where losers go and stream <laughs> video games to people and entertain them. So it's a high energy. I am very high energy. I'm a psychopath. But it's basically just entertaining, streaming, making sure every it's basically like the talk show host but also playing video games at the same time, multitasking like crazy. And then, um, so I do that uh, as a, a secondary job. My primary would be commercial work. And so I do acting with that and stuff like that too. Um, and then, yeah, which is why lines become much more critical and I get very overwhelmed when I can't remember that. Um, but yeah, those are the two things primarily. So if we helped you with your memory. That would make my life so much easier. Mm -hmm. So much easier. I did an audition. The first thing that happens to me is I start to panic because I know I have to try to memorize lines rather than enjoy the process because I know how difficult it is for me to remember anything. Um, and that's that's a hard one for the industry that I'm in. So, so I'm going to give you two packs. 
Max today, a grain and body power Max. It's got a great multiple vitamin, high dose, high quality fish oil, and a brain boost. It's called Brain and Memory Power Boost. It's my NFL form. Mm -hmm. Here's my problem, which I love this, and I would love to eat that whole. I can't do fish oil. I'm a vegan. Oh. So I do I do algae. I take omega-3s through algae. So, different plan then. We make something called Bright Minds Powder. Okay. It's got the multiple okay. vitamin and the brain boost. With okay. No fish oil. Okay, and perfect. he takes the omega-3 yes. from the algae. And then if you're taking the, we're going to actually start carrying an algae base. Oh, cool. Yes, omega please. Three. Um, yes. Because most of them are not strong enough. Mm -hmm. Most yeah, of them I agree. don't have EPA in them. And ours is going to have a big slug. They totally can do this. You know, mm -hmm. if it's your value and yeah. that's where you feel the best, we just have to find those strategies. Yeah. So the Bright that. Minds powder, um, scoop a day, I just put it in a shake. I mean, I like it because it cuts my supplements in half. Yeah. I put it, uh, do you do shakes in the morning? Um, not, I do a protein shake when I work out. Um, but besides that, no. I don't do anything. You usually work out every morning almost. No, I work out twice a week. That's it? Mm -hmm. Wow, you look great. So would you take much. it if I gave it to you? I mean, you could put it in water, but I think would it is better. I, I, would, so I, would, I work I would, six I would, days a week and I, would, I hate my body. Yeah, no, I, <laughs> I do very little cardio and, and working out and my body, I couldn't be happier. Um, I would ask you further what's in it, but I would be open to it, yes. I just don't know what exactly, what's the benefit of it? What, what, am, I, what am I trying to do with it? Get better blood flow to your body. So that's the, that's the intention, okay. I didn't know what this was related to, okay. So it's to give you all the nutrients you need, plus okay. improve your memory. Oh yeah, no, no, yeah. And if it's if it's healthy, yeah, I have no reason not to. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So um, that, and then focus energy if you needed it, because it also helps to increase blood flow for you. That's what yeah, that would um, be interesting. I'm thinking. I'm so excited. If I can try. get you your memory better, I'm very excited about that. I'm slightly um, skeptic. But very excited. Well, we'll see. <laughs> I'm very much so like, let's do this all in the most healthy way possible. I'm not, I don't enjoy pills. I don't, unless obviously it's necessary, which I'm not, I'm not stupid. So, well, um, we can do, so there's an alternative to the powders. So what I powders, did, I'm, 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 that's, a, that's okay with me, but. Okay. I mean, it'll save you 10 pills. 10 capsules if you do the powder. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and you'll have your smoothies every morning. It'll be nice. No, that's fine. Well, and then let me know. Frankie's got my cell phone. I never mind if you guys text me. Whenever you do, I always respond. Yeah, he's Please, great. Um, Appreciate it. All in making your brain better. Yeah. This is my passion. Love that. In life. <laughs> it's, a, it's very important.